Hey gang, I wanted to quickly show you how to make an, a Squarespace image slider that is super simple to install and set up. So you see here I have a page with a bunch of sections stacked on top of each other. I want my section two through section five to be slides, just stacked on top of each other and move left and right. So all I gotta do is go to my website here. Here is my website, willmyers.com, and I'm gonna copy this code that I have, link in the description and then jump to my page. So here is my page that I want to put the slider on. I'm gonna hit this gear icon. I'm gonna hit advanced and paste my code into the advanced header section. Uh, if you have jQuery already installed on your, on your website, you can delete this. If you don't know what I'm talking about, leave it in, just that'll make sure it works. And I want sliders, my first section through my fifth section to be part of my slideshow. So I'm going to save. You'll see it's going to reformat all this and now one through five, sections one through five are part of my my slideshow and then section six is right below it. So I can just hit this slider button and it's going to easily move things across. This also works on the Brine template in Squarespace 7.0. If you your website is on Brine, it works the exact same way super easy to set up super easy to install if you want to change any of these uh, i will say you have to be you have to have an index uh you have to be doing the index and then pages on the index but that's how you get it to work and if you want to change any of these go into the, your gear icon change advanced settings you can make your starting section two this is something you can a fun little tweak you can hit save and now my first section right here is still at the top and it's not part of my slideshow. And my slideshow starts here from section two through section five. So this is why section six is below because I can one, two, three. And you can easily edit any of these sections. This isn't HTML code or anything. Just hit this gear icon. Again, go back into the code, turn this let slider on, turn this to false, false. And then I'm going to hit save. It's going to stop all of that code from running. And then I can edit each one of these sections. Maybe I want this to be left justified. And I'm going to move this content align all this stuff over to the left. Maybe I want this to be right justified. Content align this all the way over to the right. Uh, we'll move this button over to the right too. And then I'm going to move this button over to the left, center left. And let's hit done and save. Now let's jump back into our code and turn let slider on to true. It's gonna put it all back together. And then here we go. So here's our top section one, section two over here. You notice I didn't have to change any code. It just, you just edit these sections like you normally would. Put in a background video if you want, doesn't matter do the, if you want to put an overlay, this is Squarespace 7.1, you can do this. Hit background, here's my image, and just change the overlay on that image in particular. You can easily change all of these settings. This looks like Squarespace is being a little glitchy for me, but uh, once you hit save. Now I've opened this page up in a new private window. So here I am, I'm in a new private tab, and I'm gonna just hit refresh. And you can see here it is live. If you want, I have a paid version of this tutorial that has an autoplay button. So when you, re when you load the page up, it auto starts the slideshow. So you see this is pause. Right now I have it set to four seconds. You can change that to whatever you want. Three seconds, 10 seconds, you can do whatever you want. I'll also add in some other CSS snippets where you can move some stuff around and play with it. But that's in my online store. If you are watching this on YouTube, just go to the link in the description, then hit the purchase tab, and you will see where you can get this. Super affordable. It's like 10 bucks. So I hope this helps. Let me know if you have any questions, and adios.